Today, the Member of Parliament for Edmonton Centre, Honorable James Cumming, is in town and he is going to meet and have a short conversation with Jason from the 24 Hero Worldwide. When I was injured on the rigs and the oil and gas, I actually spent time with the Hope Mission and the Salvation Army, so it's personal for me. I was driving by, I live in the area, I was driving by downtown Edmonton every day and I've seen people on the streets uh, pouring rain, sitting in wheelchairs, getting poured, soaking wet, crawling on the sidewalks and it really hit me hard what is being done. So I started to rip the seats out of my van about four months ago. Uh, I'm not working in oil and gas right now as a safety consultant and uh, I started just to do what I could do every day which was give food, water, coffees uh, to the homeless and that's how it started four months ago for me. So, And what have you seen with the health crisis that's on right now with COVID? Have you seen an acceleration of demand? Do you see more people struggling? You know, the economy in Alberta hasn't been great. You're an example of that. You're working in the oil patch and, and uh, you know, ended up not having a job. So what are you seeing out there and what are you hearing from the people? The, the need is huge downtown. There's a couple more thousand people on the streets. I've talked to the businesses downtown, Chinatown, to the city, to the police, to uh, send emails to the Oilers, to the Cates group. I'm trying to be a liaison for all these different groups, but the need is huge. The homeless are coming up to me crying uh, to me and to other people, to the police saying, help us. We're scared. We have no place to go. Um, people are dying down here and it's not because of COVID, it's because of other issues. So it's a real challenge and I'm just looking to su for support from businesses in Edmonton for Edmontonians to step up because people desperately need help down here. It's, it's, a, it's a big emergency. And, and, your, and your motivation, that's what I really like, it's kindness of your heart. You just really care, Jason, right? That's why you're doing that. Absolutely. Like I said, 20 years ago, I was injured on, on an oil rig accident. I lost everything. I had no support. Um, company wrongfully dismissed me. No support from WCB. And uh, I've been through it personally. I've been to Hope Mission. I can't even talk about the things that I've seen down there at Salvation Army. And to see Edmontonians, Canadians, and uh, in the city of Champions, people dying on the streets and suffering the way people are suffering down here, it's, it hits me very hard. So Jason, one of my messages has been for the community to really get out and support small businesses because they're struggling too as much as people in downtown Edmonton are struggling. What do you need from businesses? What are you looking for? You're looking for a little bit of help? You're looking for people to donate some goods? So what Absolutely. is it that they can help you with? There are sponsors right now behind me who I can't mention that are donating food daily. Um, but I talked with a businessman a couple of days ago. He owns a business, a couple of businesses in downtown uh, Edmonton. There's probably worth about $100 million himself alone. There's businesses in downtown Edmonton that can give. And people need to come together, all these agencies, police, government, uh, Premier, Mayor, City, Cates Group, Oilers, all these people need to get on the same page and tackle this issue. There's a hundred million dollar, billion dollar building sitting here. We got hundred million dollar players here do donating 24 pizzas to 2,000 homeless. Uh, something's not right here folks and as Edmontonians we can tackle this issue but everybody's passing the buck and that time for fancy letters and fancy uh, talk is over with. Let your actions speak uh, louder than your words and your fancy letters. It's, it's time to step up. So Great. Jason, listen, thank you for what you do. It, it hasn't gone unnoticed. It's not about me. It's about the people that need help down here. So Excellent. I appreciate you taking Excellent. time to talk to me, James. All right. Thanks a lot. Thank you. <laughs> thank All you, right. Jason, for the great job that you are doing. And I want to appeal to everyone watching this video to step up and give and meet the needs of the homeless wherever you are. My next video with the Honorable MP will be on hashtag Zimbabwean Lives Matter. Please subscribe and share this video.